Hey everyone, how you doing? It is Lori, and I am here to do your uplifting reading all about you. I'm going to try something different here, um, where you can't see the cards, but you get a different view. How about that? Let me know what you think. Do you like being able to have this and just hearing me? Um, I'm also thinking about doing different things. What do you guys suggest? So that you're not looking at exactly the same thing all the time. What would you suggest I do to make this channel more interesting for you? All right. Let us, I would love your feedback, okay? Give me your feedback. You know, I love you guys. I trust you guys. And I need to hear from you because I'm always trying to come up with something that will make it better for you. All right. I would like to know what is truly magical about you. You got the Ten of Cups here. You are an abundant person. You are grateful for what you have. You have a really nice life, I'm hearing. You're very comfortable, very connected. You also have a very large, um, okay, spirit saying large is not the right word. Your family may feel like a large family, even though you may only have four people in it, okay? Okay. I'm I'm trying to come up with a word that they're what the energy of what it is they're trying to say here with that large um expansive so like even though there's only four people it feels huge the love is really deep it's it's abundant everything about your family is abundant it's really really beneficial really good um, this isn't just your family. I'm going to move this down just a touch so when I hold the card up, there we go. All right. Um, it's not just your family. It's your whole life. Everything's connected, and you feel very connected to everyone around you. You've got really great relationships. Um, there's always a lot of healing going on. You know, it's like letting, um, I just heard, the rivers of time Letting the rivers of time heal all wounds. Something like that just came through. But, you you know, there's an understanding that you have more than enough. I keep getting more than abundance. It's more than abundant and you're more than grateful. Um contentment is coming through here too that cat laying like this is just telling me it's contentment by the way i'm using the everyday witch tarot there's a baby here there's a young teenage person here and two adults i don't know why but i'm getting blended family you just have really good relationships with whoever Okay, so that's truly magical about you. Whoever you encounter, oh, I'm hearing too. Okay, that's why it was large. That's why it was expansive. Whenever you meet somebody who might need someone, you take them in. You, you take in strays. You take in stray people. You take in stray animals. That's what was trying to come through earlier. Okay, beautiful. You have a very abundant life, abundant heart. Your your family includes people, animals. I mean, just you, you are the adoption agency. You take everybody in and you take care of all these people around you. And they give to you just, a, just as much as you give to them. They return. They give it to you. They give it to each other. Okay? Beautiful energy here. All right. This is what you've overcome is the death energy. So something ended, something major in your life ended. You could possibly have had a near death experience at some point and literally overcome death. Okay. What I'm hearing from most, most of you, and by the way, I'm glad you're still here with us if you did go through that. I'm sure that was quite a, an experience. I've had my own. Um, what I am hearing from most of you, though, is you made a choice about something in your life and it did not go the way that you had planned. You could have lost all your money. You could have lost all your friends. You could have lost all your family. Something really took everything from you, okay? And you overcame that. You got past that. You moved past that. Beautiful, beautiful. I mean, that is impressive how hard you had to work 
And you did, and I'm actually hearing a lot of it was cutting cords. Look at this. There's a wire right here, and this this image, this person, this entity, what energy, whatever, literally just sliced through that cord. So there's some cord cutting that was going on. Um, past behaviors is what I'm hearing. I really am getting from this card that a lot of you may have lost a lot of money. Okay. Personal belongings um, through addictions, bad behaviors, bad practices, bad thought processes, things that just did not work the way you thought that they were going to. That's kind of different. All right, let us see what kind of influence you have on the people around you. Temperance, beautiful, balance, harmony, peace. <laughs> even if even if people think you're a little weird, um, and I'm saying that because this one's, it came through. It came through. You're not weird, okay? You are unique. You're yourself. You are cool. And that, that actually is what the weird is. If people think you're weird, that's awesome because they think you're unique and different. That is what's coming through here. And a lot of people want to be unique, want to be different from everyone else, but they don't know how to be without fear, okay? They fear that they'll be ridiculed, that they'll be laughed at, um, that they'll be put down. And you may actually help them to see that their own uniqueness, that it's okay to just be you. And so you may be inspiring people here um, through your actions, just who you are as a role model. I love that. But you, you come across as very um, <laughs> unique and different. I don't know why I keep laughing when I hear it. Oh, you're so weird. You know, okay? And I, it's a good type of thing. People love this type of weird. Your unique quality, whatever it is. Okay? People do admire that. So keep that in mind. That's a good, good energy. I'm going to actually move all my cards this way today. This was the last one. So we will go like this. All right. So we'll start here and come around. That way you can see all the cards. All right, so what is a talent or skill that you have that we should know about? This came up in your daily and it was so much fun. The judgment card here, that you are very good at letting go of the past, marching to the beat of your own drum, um, listening to your own heart, <sighs> being the leader of your own parade too, like just going and having fun. This has fool's energy to it. Like the hero's journey is just beginning and everything is perfect in the world. I'm not carrying any baggage. I'm not holding, being held back by anything. Okay. There's transformation happening here. There's playfulness. There's fun. Music lightens the mood, tames the beast. Beautiful energy, beautiful skill that to have. All right, so some of you might actually be musicians or band leaders or just leaders in general, lightening people's day, lightening, um, lightening up the energies wherever you go, okay? And I, I am getting, again, people will follow you. Oh, oh, so some of you are influencers, okay? And people think that your unique perspective is awesome and worth following. Beautiful. Okay, so if you are an influencer, it looks like you may have held a different type of job in the past. You put all your effort into it, all everything you had into that. You may have put 20, 30 years um, into this, a minimum of 13. It looks like you put a long time into it and that ended. And you had to become creative. You couldn't just give up and you would never just give up. You found balance and harmony and peace and then you rose above that situation. You, you found your unique quality and that is what brought you temperance. That is what brought you this sense of balance. You could have given in to anger. You could have given in to resentment. You could have given in to, to depression. But no, 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 no. These are my Libras with that sword right there. That air energy. Cutting that cord. I'm not going to be held back. Nope. 
All right, beautiful message here for you guys. All right, so let's see. What do you do right now that you should always continue to do? Never stop doing this. You got the three of pentacles. This is all about you working well with others, being your own unique self, okay? But peace and harmony with those around you. Everybody's got something to offer here. And you, you enjoy that and you encourage it. Beautiful. And staying playful. Okay, staying playful. There's three pentacles. There's three cats. So everybody has their own way of doing things. But it's kind of similar. So this, this could be a tribe, a new group of people, your family. You know, you're just your overall energy too. All right, let's see what we end here with. The three of wands. So you have double threes here. This is awesome. This is about you knowing what you want from the future and nothing's going to hold you back from receiving it. You're actively working towards creating and calling in and man manifesting exactly what it is you want from your future. You've taken your hat off. You've thrown it on the ground. Caution to the wind. You're doing what has to be done. You are standing steadfast and making your ships come in. Working. You're you're I'm hearing ardently, A-R-D-E-N-T-L-Y, ardently working towards bringing in your, your dreams, your desires, your goals, whatever it is you're trying to do, you're doing it. You are bringing it to you. Beautiful message here for you guys. Gorgeous message. Loving message. Energetic creative. I love this message for you. All right, let's get you some uh, Oracle messages. I know you won't be able to see them, but I'm going to use the uh, small deck of Oracle mess animal spirits here. Let's see what animal spirits besides these lovely cats are going to come with you. All right, we've got three of them today. I think it's funny that the very first one is a bird, but it's intuitive. Okay, it's the loon. And it says intuitive. Listen to the song that is in your soul. Trust your intuition as you have a way of understanding. Emerge from the busy life. Take a break from the busy life and seek more quiet time. Maybe meditation. Maybe more balance. Okay. And then recognize that you are unique. You are unique and you should appreciate that and embrace that because you are loved it says right here okay beautiful message then you have the lynx a cat keeper of secrets yep each of these familiar cats keeps the secrets of their um their witch take time out from the world and just be the observer watch what's going on around you meditate just absorb it all like these people are just enjoying, they're absorbing the energy. Same here in this Three of Pentacles. Nothing will be able to, to deceive you when you trust your intuition. You see others' secrets and then you keep those secrets. In silence and satitude. Satitude? What is satitude? <laughs> Today's a day for Lorieisms, isn't it? Okay. Satitude. So in silence and solitude, you will find your strength. Love that. Let's put that one over here. Oh my gosh. And you are not going to believe what we ended up with. We have got the cat. Independent. You are a natural born healer. Your intuition is very strong. You don't have to go with the crowd, and you usually will not. You will lead the way, beating your own drum, playing your own music, leading your own parade. Ah, life supports you in every way. I absolutely love this message for you guys. That was incredible. Incredible. All right, let's get you a crystal. Um, an eternal crystals oracle message here. Let's see what crystal message we have for you today. I hope you guys are all happy, healthy, and having some fun. I love you guys to pieces for always being here. All your comments, always being supportive. 
to me, to each other, you know, great ideas, fun. I loved all your jokes, by the way. Thank you. All right, you've got fluorite, spirit guides, <laughs> third eye chakra. Uh, this is card 16, so that's a seven. We know that that's about luck and things changing for you. Really good things are coming your way. Let's pick one more here. Malachite, 27, which is a nine, and we know that that's about releasing negative energies, okay? Anything that doesn't work right for you. All right, let's go ahead and see. This is about nature, getting back to nature, trusting nature. Look at this. These people are picnicking outside, and that's what Spirit wants to say. Reconnect with nature. Maybe you need time to um, meditate. I, I We heard that earlier. Okay, there is something about and being out away from the busyness of life. That's an important message right now. Meditation getting reconnecting with the nature, reconnecting with yourself so that you can focus on your intuition again. Some of you may have been losing touch or contact with your intuition. All right, what is there anything else we're going to get here? Yes. We're going to do a witchlings um Book of Spells, okay? No spells, just some encouragement here, some wonderful information. All right, we got three cards here. We got Aura. A healthy aura keeps your energy in balance and harm harmony. All right, and then we have Enthusiasm. Life is always brighter when you wake up each day with the spirit of enthusiasm, ready to have some fun. And then you have Wish. I'm sorry. A wish motivates the heart's desire, keeping hope and faith alive. Absolutely. I'll hold these two up real quick for you. So this is Aura. That is Enthusiasm. All right. And then you had Wish. All right. Let's get you three yes or no answers here. One through five on the number die is a no. Six through 12 is a yes. Let's go ahead and see what we've got for you. Answer number one, yes or no, is a nine. That is a yes. You also have seven, 12, 11, and I do see a 10 down here, just barely. So you must be just about over that. All right, let's see what answer number two, yes or no, is. That's a four. Oh, this is a major no, okay? This is a big no. Four, and then you have six, 10, and eight. I do see 11 down here, but it's it's like it, I can see it and not see it. See it and not see it. Answer number three is a 10. That is a yes answer for you. Yes, 10, 11, 12, 9. You may go forward. You may step back. You might go forward. Okay, so it's not going to be just one direct path. You're going to have to um, flow around some obstacles. Beautiful energy here. All right, check out the description box for um, personal reading information, how to join my email list. Um, do the, Join the email list if you are interested in um, small group, uh, maybe Zoom meetings, okay? We'll talk more about that, Just but get on my email list, and uh, I'll send something out soon about that. Tickle tap or boop the like button. Claim this as your message if this is you or even if it's not. If you want to just claim it, drop a comment, okay? Tell me what you think about the message, about the cards, about the view. What would you like to see? I want to hear from you guys. I love you to pieces until our energy crosses again. I'm wishing you much peace, love, and happiness. Bye-bye.